Bada bing, bada boom. Greetings, everyone. BJ Weller back with you for the end. Yeah, this is it. We have reached the end, and I wasn't sure whether we were going to reach it or not because I couldn't get Tropico to load. I had to actually go into the game files and uh, and load it from the EXE itself instead of from Steam. So I don't know what was going on there. But anyway, it's got we got it loaded up. We're ready to go. We're ready to rock and roll with the final game of our classic gaming minithon. All to raise money for the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. I am your host, BJ Wilder. Thank you, everyone who has joined me throughout the day today. Everyone who has hosted today. Uh, who, who, Battery H, Nascent Games, uh, Tasmanian Devil's Bro. Thank you, one and all. Uh, thank you for the follows, Danger Hion. Uh, much, much appreciated. Thank you for the bits, battery. Thank you for everyone who's just hung out, either the lurk or chat today. It is much, much appreciated. $150 in of our initial $250 step goal for the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. 100%, 100%. Every single penny that we raise through our Extra Life Gaming efforts goes to helping sick kids get better at CHOP, goes to help improving their lives. In one way or another. Somehow, some way. Yes, that's what it's used for. You can donate safely, securely, and anonymously by clicking the big old extra life banner down below the live stream window. Or check out the video description if you're watching this on Twitch and or YouTube. Uh, that information is in the video description. Ultimate goal this year is $1,000. And as an extra added incentive uh, for the total amount you donate for 2019, be it over... Uh, a couple of different donations that you make through the year or just one lump donation for the year. Uh, you can earn yourself some cool RMG Gaming and uh, uh, Real Millennium Group and some original artwork uh, reward stuff based on how much you end up donating for the entire year. So be sure to check that out, that banner down below or the uh, video description links. Be sure uh, to check them out and uh, make a donation, even one dollar. One dollar can make a difference to the kids. And to the hospital, as we can see through the videos that we saw today. A lot of great stuff that CHOP is able to do with the money we raise through CMN and Extra Life. Just simply by playing the game. But thank you, everyone, for uh, hanging out with me. Where are we at now? Eight hours and almost 40 minutes into it. We are on our final game here. Uh, it's been great fun. I'm glad to... Uh, I, was debating, I was debating, like, uh, even through vacation. And like the beginning of this week is like, oh, do I, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it. I got the kids, you know, I got to take care of the kids. There's still stuff around to do around the house, stuff like that. It's like, kept, even last night I was like, oh, I don't know if I'm really going to be up for doing, doing like a, 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 a 10 hour marathon or, or a mini-thon or anything like that because there's so much else going on right now. I said, well, let me dig in. Let, let, let me at least do something. Um, and, and try it, and here we are, eight and a half hours later, it's like the time has flown by. And it's all thanks to everybody out there who's been hanging out with me today, either lurking, like I said, or just uh, hanging out and chatting, like Cat, Taz, and Battery. It's all much, much appreciated uh, at the end of the day. So let's uh, let's just rock and roll. Let's get it on, because we, we are running late. You know, we had a few issues here and there. We did get started 15 minutes late, but... A couple of issues with uh, getting the games running, like I said, the last, the last two uh, last two games here. Stronghold Crusader just wrapping up now uh, with Tropico. So let's uh, let's 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 crank it out here if I can do stuff the right way here. Uh, and then I want that one. There we go. Yes, there we go. All right. So let's just uh, let's just get rocking here. Um, now we don't need the tutorial, but I want to do. Now, of course, this is on the older system, so I don't have as many. I don't have as many saves here. I just got Wilder Island. Um, this is the first one that I started here. Uh, let's go into this. Let's just see where we're at. I think this is the one that I ended up getting hit by the hurricane and then getting ousted as leader here. I might. What I might end up doing is going. Uh, because disasters are on. Yeah, see, this is after the disaster. or This is after the hurricane hit already. So that's not going to help. Because I'm about to get ousted. And we're going to end up having to start again anyway. Um, so maybe I can try a, a scenario here. Do I have any scenarios here? Okay. Some offers are too good to resist, Presidente. The Americans want us to mine our land and ship them raw materials. Normally, you would be wise to favor a balanced economy. But with the Americans willing to pay, 
and pay well for minerals, we should uh, break out the pick and shovel. Presidente set aside cabbages and carrots and go for the gold. Another fish in the sea. Yeah, see, at least as far as fishing, you know, you wonder read the ship skills. You've managed to establish your strong fishing, however, you can't help but look at some of your Caribbean friends and wonder if you're missing something uh, with this whole tour. So we can make it a, a tourism island back to the skies. You're unlucky for you to be on Yaman Airlines only plane. After a storm force of plane down on the island, people have elected you and your all your glory to be their leader until an airport can be built to fly home. Keep them alive and happy with what you can, and uh, whatever happens, don't get ousted from power. So that's moderate, that's moderate. So this is an easy one. Born again, very hard. Earthquake. Only 20 people and almost no infrastructure. Wow. Club Tropico, moderate. Huge hotel resorts, yada yada. Comrades, moderate. Dowder Island, moderate. All right, so let's go, let's, let's do this one. This, this is the easy one. Let's see how we do with this. Uh, let's pair this island miscellaneous scenarios. Oh, here we go. All right. These are a list of all scenarios. Oh, oh wow. So there is more. No bananas. Trista Trapano. Triassic Park, really. Turn Tropico into dinosaur farm, really. <laughs> that almost might be interesting to do there. Good Earth, Taiwan hard, Oop. summer games, spring break down. All right, let's do let's do this one. Let's do. Uh, Build this airport. Uh, paradise tourism scenarios, military scenarios, original scenarios. Okay. So let's, let's try this one. Random events. To off. Yes, that's exactly what we want. This is what we should have done on Weiler Island. Didn't realize it. Okay, so it looks like our goal is to build an airport here, so let's see what we can do. Not sure what we can do here, eh? Uh, welcome to your island paradise, Presidente. Your goal is to earn enough money to build an airstrip within 20 years so we can go home. Be careful where you place your buildings as the island is very small, and remember, the airstrip will take a long time to build because of the woods. Oh, and of course, trade and immigration will be minimal, so you'll want to make sure your island is self-sustaining. Good luck. Uh, what do you mean we can't use the boats to leave? It's not in the script, you know. <laughs> Why can't we just use the boat? Oh, it's not in the script. Oh, you know that, Presidente. Okay, so let's, um, yeah, see, here. Scroll wheel to zoom out. Um, I think, uh, no, let's, oh, hold on. Exit. There we go, that's right. Cursor to the ground there. So we've got airport. Are we paused? Yeah, I think we're paused right now. Yep. So let's see what we have in terms of farming capability. We got some, okay, there's our corn fishermen. Do we even have, doesn't look like Fishermen. Yeah, it doesn't look like we have good fishing opportunities at all. Uh, logging camp. Obviously, we can do some logging. Cattle ranch. Looks like we can do a wee bit of cattle. Wow, it's the only mineral mineral deposit we have out here. There's no iron. This is a small iron, no bauxite. So just gold. I only have gold, so I don't know how well that's going to help. Rum distillery, so all this stuff. Tourism, I don't think we're going to have to worry about tourism. Um, house, country house, bunkhouse, condominium. 
luxury house, tenement. Hey, how much? Ooh, wow. We only have forty-five hundred dollars too. I gotta remember, I, I I don't have unlimited funds here. So I guess what we're gonna need is some corn farming. It looks like we got some good corn reserves up here. So we'll go ahead and do that. So let's start with that. Edicts, I don't know if we even need edicts. Anything, a bunkhouse, maybe. Oops. We got, there we go. That's how we move. So, where is... Yeah, where is our airport? That's the uh, key. What's this here? Uh, so, we already have a logging camp. All right. Plus, uh, causes that area's been cut down, regenerated twenty. Now I don't need that tool shop. Uh, Three thousand. Well, I can't afford that. So we got some corn going on here. Restaurant, nightclub. Ah, here's our airport. Okay. And we don't have enough cash, so we're definitely going to have to get some cash here, too, aren't we? Ugh. All right, so let's, uh, and we got 20 years to build this airport. Uh, let's see what we got here. Yeah, I'm not going to worry about Swiss bank account. Yeah, we're losing money. Logging profits, nothing. Well, that's not good. Again. Okay, let's see where we're at here. Ugh. All right, let's let's speed time up here a bit here. So get this stuff built. System too, but it shouldn't be that much of an issue. We got shacks going. What exactly does this airport need to be built? That's the question. Ah, ooh, this is huge. Yes, it doesn't matter. It just needs to go anywhere. Everybody's just going to be living in shacks. I don't know, I might have to, uh... ...reduce the wages of this logging camp. This is not costing us as much money here. Yeah. <laughs> 
how how are we gonna get income now? That's the question. Maybe I need to build a gold mine to do our income. Right now we are losing money and that's not gonna help, especially expenses. Construction. Okay. We got no more construction anyway. Got no profits on farming or mining. I might have to I might have to build a gold farm or a gold mine. That might be what we need to do. Force, yeah, okay, I'm not worried about military. I can't I can't afford the military. So let's go in here. Oh, we don't even have enough to build a gold mine. Oh little. So that's not gonna help. We have two tourists, really? <laughs> That's funny. They're concerned about democracy. I'm just concerned about building a damn airport. Infrastructure, see wages. years left to build the airport. Okay. Well, I can't do much of anything now. Until, uh, get some cash going in here. Okay. We lost $203 in profit. It's fabulous. Oh, we got some foreign aid at least. Russia and the U.S. are giving us foreign aid. That yeah, still doesn't help. rocking it. Okay. The people are quite lawless, my president. Perhaps if you hire some police, things will improve. Yeah, well... Maybe. Let me get through another year here and see what happens. Whatsoever. This is supposed to be easy. 
scenario. All right, so we we got some money back there. Let's pause for now. All right, so no special. Uh, so okay, we made three hundred nine dollars without doing any construction. Okay. Now we're starting to make money, so we're still we still don't have any profits from farming or logging. So we're gonna have to we're gonna have to try to get gold going in here somehow. Still don't have enough money for gold. So we actually have to let time pass here a bit. We can uh, maybe, hopefully, export some gold. Uh, it's a storm. Clouds are in my way. There we go. Alright. Hopefully we can get another year here. Get gold mining. Maybe export gold. I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to save before we do or throw that gold mine down because I don't know if we're gonna make any profit off of it. That's the whole thing, so we'll get through this year. Thirty-one eighty-nine. Okay. Excellent. See, that's the thing. I don't see where we're exporting anything. Yeah, we'll try gold. And there's got to, there's gold on here for a reason. So let's. Uh, Save this as uh, airport scenario. Airport scenario. Okay, we have that saved as airport scenario. Let's get the gold mine over here and rock and roll and see how we do with that. See if we can even get through the year with any money here. Oh, we got some money. Okay. Just got an influx of cash here. A lot of cash. I don't know where they're from. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Little profits. One eight total. Oh, we finally made some money off of logging. Okay. The logging finally paid off. Well, thank God for that. So we're finally able to export some logs now, huh? Okay. So maybe, just maybe, 
once we can get this gold mine built, we'll be in good shape, huh? Hopefully, maybe, we'll see. Clearing out there. been completed. Uh, electricity, everything requires electricity, which I don't think we're going to, well, does the airport require electricity? It didn't say it required electricity. Where is the airport? Where, where did it go? Yeah, it just requires money, no electricity. Alright. I'm not even going to worry about electricity then. Alright, dude, his logging profits couldn't have come at a better time. We are close with Russia. We got two thousand dollars foreign aid so far. Okay. As long as we're still making some money logging. Right now logging is very profitable for us. So we need to get some people hired over here. We need people working in our mine. Let's see what we got here. Yeah, okay, I'd be a thousand. house over here. Maybe that'll encourage people to come over here. Nobody want to work at the gold mine. <coughs> How's our population? Uh, still increasing, okay. Bunkhouse has been completed at least. Alright, total profit. So it looks like logging has taken a dip a bit. As 
long as we can keep making some profit here. Oh, all right, finally got a gold miner. Finally. Have enough money for an airport. If you keep up the good work, then we can all get how uh, much money we have. And I'm sure that there are plenty of ways to spend it. Tuck some away for ourselves and leave after we have stashed away. What do you say? I like your thinking. I make my money honestly. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. At least not yet. More people working this gold mine, dang it. Mining. Mining 49 and <coughs> Alright, we're almost there for the airport. Now we got enough for the airport, so we're gonna have to start getting to the airport built. There we go. Nice. So logging paid off well again. Farming is starting to pay off now. Okay, so now we got money rolling in. The only thing we have to build is the airport. And we've got 14 years to build this airport. How long does an airport take to build? That's the question. We just got to wait for mining to uh, take off here. So what we're going to do, let's go ahead and save this again. Okay. Because I want to wait till we get a little bit more money here. You are making quite a number of enemies, Presidente. How? See what we've got and then uh, throw down the airport. Up to eighteen. So right now we'll still have over four thousand dollars once we build this airport. Oh, and we, we only got what, one more month. Yep. Okay. Right, let's see where we're at here. We got twenty thousand bucks. How are we doing? Mining still not profitable yet, but that doesn't surprise. As long as logging and farming now are profitable, that's all we need to worry about here. So there's corn, there's logs. I'm just 
get some gold exported, man. 13 years to build the airport. So we get, we're essentially getting one immigrant per year. I think I need a teamster office, don't I? <coughs> I didn't see a teamster's office anywhere. <coughs> Here's the Kingster's office. 1900, huh? Let's show the Teamsters down here. Let's get that built. Can I even get more Teamsters? All right. My president, up. the people, they suffer for lack of medical treatment. Well, they're not going to get medical treatment. The only concern I have is building the damn airport. Losing some cash now. <laughs> so we'll wait one more year then. Okay, so we got the Teamsters. Hopefully we'll get some Teamsters here, huh? Yeah, yeah, militarist, whatever. Don't need no armament, we just need an airplane. some money on farming, have we? Did we gain money on logging. So mining's going to be a steady loss, it looks like. I might just end up having to just only have one miner. Alright, well anyway, we got enough for the airport, so let's get this built. Where can, where can this airport go? Here we go. <coughs> Looks like this is the only place for the airport right here. All right, there we go. Airportness. <coughs> All right. Now it's a matter of how long will it take? <coughs> how long do we have? Twelve years to get this airport built. Let's see. I mean, so we're still good economy-wise. Foreign aid is dropping. 
but our logging is holding steady. Well, mining profits are dropping, or the negative mining profits are dropping, so that might be something. I have to keep the logging. I just I just don't have enough people. Oopsie. Election since we power eight years ago. If we don't hold elections, we risk public backlash. People feel that they cannot express their cons conscience for or against you at the ballot box. They are much more likely to take up arms against you now or in the future. All right. Oh, I am not very supportive here. I've got to get everybody on my side. Hmm. So is she my opponent? Do I need to execute her? I need to kill everybody? Well, now that guy got money here. Who's my opponent? That's why I need to find out who my opponent is in the election. Perhaps a well-timed assassination. Hola. All right, so I need to, uh, I, I definitely need to get some support here. Let's see what else we can build here. Get a clinic built. Let's see what else we can build here. Out of cash again. God, I'm losing support. What the hell is that happening? Your greatness. The people's spiritual needs are not being met. Perhaps if you build a church, the people will be more content. Okay. A church.
for the church. Oh, good God. Give me cash. Fast. Yeah, no. So I forgot I got the airport building. <laughs> I got like no support. Favorable for you. Yeah. Yes, let's go ahead and take the steps. <laughs> we're, not, we're not winning this election. I don't even think if we get 20%, because we are so. I'm going to have to start assassinating my enemies. <laughs> President. Okay, so let's... Uh, Alright, we got to go back here. I didn't, that was an easy scenario. Are you serious? Alright, so let's... Uh, Let's load that one back in where we were at. I think this is before we built the airport. So we need to get the clinic. I need to get the clinic and the... Uh, and the police the clinic and the church built first. So let's get the clinic built. We get the church built. Let's speed that up. You are making quite a number of enemies, Presidente. Yeah, well, you know what? Our enemies might have to start getting assassinated. Hola. See, I don't have the Teamsters built yet, even. So I was mad because I couldn't get any Teamsters to come in. So I may, I may just have to give up the gold mine. We couldn't make any, pro we couldn't make any profit on that whatsoever.
we got church built. Presidente, I believe some of your people may be calling for an election next year. <laughs> Wonderful. Who will assassinate him? Money to kill people, though, huh? Mm. So there is my. Let's check my overall popularity here for a moment. Happiness is still going down. Respect going down. That's far too many detractors. Even the babies are unhappy. Healthcare, all right, so rest, religion, so I mean, we've got gotten that taken care of. Entertainment. Some need healthcare. So it looks like entertainment. So let's build something that's gonna be entertaining. <coughs> Pub, nightclub, only restaurant, restaurant. Pub, so it's 60. Yeah, interesting, that's 1900. Cabaret, 3800. Since we're going to build ourselves a pub. Okay. Let's go. Hopefully, we can make some. Hopefully, this will be enough. for the airport. Alright, let's see. Let's see if we can bring some happiness to our people. Of course I mean they're worried about crime too, so I might need a police station. Is that gonna cost me? That's super civic. This station is 1900, okay. Oh, we're losing money again. Of course we are. Logging is dropping. Farming hasn't kicked in yet. Losing money on tourism and entertainment. Maintenance, so okay. We got religion. We got healthcare. What more do you people want? All right, let's, uh, hmm. Let's 
not have elections. Your people no longer feel that staring at grass is fun. They need more entertainment, my president. Oh, I gave him the pub. <laughs> uh, let's build the police station anyway. Hopefully we can get some profits on something here. <coughs> corn, corn and bow logging just, just dropped off the map for God's sakes. How much time do I have left? <coughs> no. That's the question, how much time do I have left here? Well, if I could get more people working at the mine. <coughs> know what I'm saying? Twelve years. Okay, so we got the police station. All right, so we uh, see now. I can't build the airport till I get money. That's the problem. I need money. I need monies. They have nowhere near enough monies. So we might have to go back, forego elections, and just hope the airport can get built in time before something happens. Because I just don't see how I'm going to get enough money to get in here and get this done. Okay, see, we've got nobody for religion here. Alright, let's pay the fee. Get somebody in here for that. The Clinic. people are We're quite good. lawless, okay. my president. Perhaps if you hire some police, things will improve. We got <laughs> police. So we got police, so we're good there. That's fine. So we got our religion going. Okay. Oops. Take a look at that in a minute. Sorry you have been in office for 10 years now, Presidente. Keep up the good work. Yeah, well, I still, get, I, I still have to get my uh, airport built. And now I'm not making any profit. Enough profit to get my <coughs> airport built. <coughs> Is completely dropped off the map now. Logging's back up at least. We still haven't got anything off this gold mine. It looks like it was a mistake to build the gold mine. Got no profit off of that at all. Money. We need quite a bit more money here. Hmm. 
I don't know if we can do it. Seven thousand more dollars here. Nothing. The logging profits are kicking back up, but farming profits are done. Alright, so we may have to do that. I may just have to get rid of the iron mine because we're not making any money off of that whatsoever. can't get anybody else hired for that. So let's bulldoze that. That just that's doing nothing for us except eating up profits. That's done. Right, let's take a look at our happiness. How's the happiness right now? Happiness is holding steady at least. Religion holding steady. Housing quality going up at least. Entertainment going up, healthcare going up, crime safety going up. Overall respect is still dropping now. But we don't have to worry about elections at this point. We need to worry about monies. That's the key to monies. Yeah, that's okay. We ain't got no more monies for it. <coughs> She's not making enough money now. Yeah, look at that. Tornades dropping, logging's dropping. Farming's back up, but it's still not going to be enough. We only got eight years to build this airport. I can't even afford it. All right, so let's do this. <coughs> okay, let's pause. Let's get rid of the, let's get rid of the iron mine right now. Obviously, that's not doing anything for us. And we're building the airport right now. You are making quite a number of enemies, President. I know. I got no choice. Without building the airport, I got nothing. So let's see where this gets us. Save money. I ain't building nothing else. We're just waiting for this airport to get done here. Priority. <coughs> so we're gonna wait and see how we do here. See what. Uh, see what happens. Well, do I? Well, let me see it.
Something fell in the party. Okay, hold on. Okay, we got a lot taken care of anyway. Oh boy, oh boy, are we something? All right, let's see where we're at here. Uh, overview. Uh, happiness dropping. Oh well, yeah, this one I figured happiness is dropping. Expenses, of course, from uh, building the airport. We're still all right. Logging good. Mining's done, so we're not have to worry about mining taking care of that so we just need to rock and roll and hopefully <coughs> hopefully 13 years is enough to get this airport built so we'll see <coughs> we shall see it's just a sitting and waiting game at this point. My president, the people, they suffer for lack of medical treatment. Well, they're going to keep suffering because uh, when I gave them a clinic, I had no more money to give them a freaking airport. We got to get the airport built first. Because all of a sudden, all our profits, all, all our, our export profits drop away once I give them everything else. So they're just gonna, they're just gonna have to deal. Right, there we go. They're clearing the trees away now. See if we can get this done here. I thought this is going to I wasn't going to get an hour out of this scenario. <laughs> we are. Where are we at? An hour and ten minutes later, and I still don't know if I'm going to win the dang thing. Yeah, okay, whatever. What it is, what it is, what it is. Okay, here we go. Ugh. Okay. 
Yes, we're losing money. Of course we're losing money. Because, oh yes, and now you can see we're losing money on logging profits. Oh, for God's sakes. Alright, let's just keep going. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Yeah. Uh, oh, wow. Well, heck, I got better support than I have so far. But, um... What do we do? 11... And no. No, we're just getting the airport built. They can deal with it. They can deal without the free election so we get this... God forsaken airport built. Your people no longer feel that staring at grass is fun. They need more entertainment, my president. Well, they're gonna be out of luck, says I. Out of luck. There, okay. Uh, yeah, I'll give you a voice and concerns. Alright, well, we almost got the trees cleared out. <coughs> How much time do we have left here? 12 years? Okay, looks like we, we might. We might have enough... A good number of years to be able to get, uh... Get this done. What's our economy? That's the only thing I'm really concerned about. Alright, we're back to getting profits on logging at least, okay. So that's good. That's good at least. Okay, we're almost there. Almost there, says I. Okay. Yeah, it looks like we're getting some money back now, so maybe... Well, once I get the airport built, that's a win scenario. See, that's the thing. You gotta get the airport built when you have the money to do it. You gotta lay it down when you have the money to do it. But if you need to build anything else, you gotta wait for the airport to finish. Here there, you make the airport low zero priority and get the other stuff built. See now we're now we're getting profit back here. But then what's the point? You can get the airport built before you're ousted. Your greatness, the people's spiritual needs are not being met. Perhaps if you build a church, the people will be more well, content. Well, I tried, and then I couldn't make enough money to build my airport. Now, come on now. Happiness is not dropping anyway. Yeah, see that? Now we're back to making a profit on logging. Yeah, they are unhappy. Plenty of unhappy people. Well, they're just going to have to deal with it. 
since we almost have this done. So you essentially have to ignore the elections. You have been in office for 10 years now, Presidente. <coughs> Keep up the good work. You essentially have to ignore the elections and just hope you get the airport built in time. So we got 10 more years to go to get this airport done. Amazing how we get five thousand dollars one year, and next year, nothing. That's amazing. <laughs> the people are quite sure lawless, my president. Perhaps if you hire some police, things will improve. Yeah, no, because we can't make money. We're going to have to deal with it till we get the rest of these trees cleared out here. What are they doing? What the heck is that? Wow. They're still still working the land. They, we have not even not even started on this airport yet, and we got nine years. Oh my god! I thought we had plenty of time. Now I don't know. Yeah, okay. So yeah, now they now we gotta level out all the land is what they're doing. Alright, we're fine with that. We're just wait we're just trying to wait to get this thing built. Oh look at that, we got some monies again. Let me take a look. <laughs> Oh, look, profits. Yeah. Logging profits are bad. There's a shock. You see, you see, if you're tempted to go ahead and do, like, the church or the entertainment or the police or something like that, it means you got to put this on the hold and have them focus on that. Well, at this point, <coughs> and we're, we're down to almost eight years here. Yeah, we got eight years left. And they haven't even started constructing this thing yet. No 
idea what these people are doing. There we go. There we go. Now we're finally working on the airport, for God's sakes. Seven took... Jesus, it took like four or five years just to terraform. Good God almighty. Like we might actually have this airport done just in time to hit 10 hours and have our mini-thon complete. Our classic gaming mini-thon. Great fun, great fun. So thank you for joining me today, everybody. Much, much appreciated. We have 120 days to go. What is that? Four months? Yeah, four months? Yeah, four months. Before we begin our 25-hour gaming marathon for extra life to raise money for the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. November 1st, 2019, 4 p.m. Eastern Time, we'll be beginning that. $150 in of our initial $250 step goal. Ultimate goal is $250 this year. Or is $1,000 this year. <laughs> That's the ultimate goal. Every single dollar counts. Thank you for all the support today. Everyone who has stopped by, who has hosted, who has followed, who has cheered bits. Much, much appreciated. And there's our airport. We've done it. There, strip is finally complete. We can all go home. Superb job. Good God. Presidente, the people have come to show you their love and respect. Presidente, the skies are clear, the water is fresh, and our lands are green. This is your doing, and the environmentalists have backed you every step of the way. Proud to call you Presidente. <laughs> yeah, sure. Too bad the capitalists did not appreciate your Spartan ways. Low profits, poor entertainment, and substandard housing may displease the fat cats, but you survived anyways. The farmers, miners, and loggers of Tropico know that you stood with them in the fields and forests to make their efforts the true economic strength of the island. I should note that your retirement from public life will not likely be easy financially. Perhaps if you had tucked away more in your Swiss account, you'll be able to maintain a more comfortable lifestyle. Presidente, despite your sometimes ruthless nature and cruel efficiency, the people as a whole have accepted your leadership. You did not tolerate disobedience or public unrest, and this has allowed Tropico to gain some measure of success amongst the countries of the world. Don't let their low happiness confuse you. The people's respect for you is genuine. Take a bow for them, my president. Well, there we go. <laughs> Minus 88 score. <laughs> yeah, we're not continuing the game. No, thank you. We are good enough. And that's it. That is it for us. Marathon, the mini thon. The class game mini thon has concluded. Thank you once again, everyone. I uh, was stopped by today. Much, much appreciated. We got it in. SimCity 2000, Civilization 2, Baldur's Gate, Stronghold Crusader, and finally Tropico. Going back to the uh, early 90s to early, uh, very early 2000s uh, for some classic gaming, all in the name of raising money for the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. Once again, everyone, 
check the banners down below the live stream window or check the video description for a link where you can go uh, to get some information about our uh, participation in Extra Life and our hospital that we represent, the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia, and of course make the donation and see what you can earn for making donations. Even one dollar at a time can make a difference to the kids. Um, you can make several donations uh, throughout the year or make one lump sum donation, whichever works for you, but you can earn rewards uh, for the amount that you donate uh, in 2019. As every little dollar is much appreciated. Uh, your support is much appreciated. Give us a follow. Give us a subscription if you like here on Twitch. Subscribe to us on YouTube where we uh, upload all our gaming content streams and uh, pre-recorded stuff as well. And check that all out. And of course, down below we have our live, uh, our live streaming schedule each week. And it's uh, much appreciated to anyone who can follow us on any of our three channels. RMG Gaming 2, we do simulation. Right here we do variety gaming uh, for fundraising for the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. And on our main channel, channel BJ Waller, we do MMOing, indie gaming, and classic gaming just like we did today. Uh, and single player gaming as well. You know, basically variety gaming minus the simulation, essentially, on channel BJ Waller. All our simulation stuff is on channel RMG game too. So thank you everyone. Please be sure to join us this weekend for more fundraising of fun and excitement for uh, Extra Life and the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. And of course starting in three weeks 100 Days of Gaming where we will be playing and streaming one game for at least one hour every single day for 100 consecutive days right here on Channel Real Millennium Group leading right up into our 25 our gaming marathon on November 1st. So 101, 102 really straight days of gaming. Gaming, streaming, no less. Right here on channel Real Millennium Group starting July 24th, ending November 2nd. So be sure to catch that as you can. I am BJ Wilder. Thank you for joining me today, everyone. It's been a great pleasure. Thank you, Cat. Uh, Battery and Taz were hanging out with me today again. Uh, much appreciated, you guys always hanging out with me. Battery for the bits, as always, much appreciated. Danger Hione for the follow, also much appreciated. And uh, Tinu uh, Liel, I think, uh, followed today as well. I somehow missed that. Perhaps it was during when uh, during one of our breaks. But uh, thank you and uh, Pisteca 13 for the follow as well. Much much appreciated uh, your support, everyone. I'm BG Well. Until next time, I will see you in game.